your hum intense clone. How you going everyone? Jared from Sensibility. Welcome back to the channel. I've got something different for you today. And it is from Sydney perfumer Jalu. Uh, the perfumer's name is Alan. He's been doing perfume for quite a while and he's definitely got a very good nose for different fragrances. This one, as you probably saw, Iris Man. What is it? It's a clone of Dior Homme Intense. The special thing about this, which he sent me a sample of, is in this little vial. This is pure orris root oil. Orris root being the root system of the iris plant and it's 100% natural. So this has natural iris in it. This one, I don't know if it's the same price as the others. These others are $70 per 100 mil. And this one might be a bit more expensive just because it's got the real iris uh, oris composition in the DNA. And it's expensive. It's very expensive. But we're going to smell it. Great atomizers on his uh, fragrances. Straight away, I love Iris. This smells like Dior Homme Intense. It smells exactly like it. It's got that beautiful lipsticky powdery Iris that just punches through the top. But you know what? There's something that's very different with this one. When a lot of people smell Dior Homme Intense, or they smell, what's other one, Iris Empire by Carolina Herrera and all that kind of things. The Iris can be very cloying. Cloying meaning it makes you feel sick. It induces headaches. It's something that can be overly sweet as well, but it's just, it's nothing that makes your nose blind. It gives you headaches and makes you feel sick, literally. Like it's too much, it's too overpowering. This one, you don't get any of that. No headaches. No, it's not overpowering. It's not making me feel sick. And there's definitely some that do. Maybe it's because it's natural versus synthetic. I'm not 100% sure. I'm not an expert. I'm just going off how I feel when I smell them. But this, I can't fault it. And that's straight off the bat, obviously dry down and all the rest of it. Um, he does mix all these by himself, so the more it sits, the better the maceration, the better the actual fragrance itself. But this, I'm gonna keep smelling it all day. If you love Iris, you're gonna love Iris Man by Jalu in New South Wales. Check him out on TikTok, that's the best way to contact him, unless you're part of the Australian Fragrance Group. Uh, his name is Alan Parrish. You can get him onto that, but Dior Homme Intense. This is probably gonna be one of the best clones you can get your hands on because it's made right here in Australia. Check it out. See you next time. Like, subscribe, do all that kind of stuff. And I will try and bring you more and more and more as much as I can. Um, I love fragrances. This is the best hobby in the world and I'll see you next time.